Christmas cookies, decorations, wreath making, and all things festive. This is the magazine to snag right now. It's Hey Roadies Holiday Issue. And here to take us inside the pages is Editor-in-Chief of Providence Media, Elise Major. Good morning. Good morning, Michaela. I, I love it. Look, I'm in red, you're in plaid. We've got the whole festive feel. Exactly. This picture alone on the cover makes you, well, makes you want to do exactly what these kids are doing. Run through a field of Christmas trees and just dive into the holiday season. Exactly. Is that what you did for this issue? That's exactly what we did. Of yeah. course, we dove into it like a month ago or, or more. But yeah. Um, yeah, that was the thing. Like we just really rounded up everything festive to do mm -hmm. from, you know, tree lightings to menorah lightings to, you know, picking your own Christmas tree to like, you know, holiday strolls and shopping small. It's right. all here. You, it, it is all there. There are a hundred plus festive things to do that you mention in this issue alone. Yes. Uh, in addition to that, there are some other great articles that we have to mention. Everyone enjoys making cookies around this time of year, but one woman in particular has taken it to the next level. Yeah, her name is Maria Vedrosen, and I had found her just because all of us at work were wondering, you know, what's what's involved in those Italian cookie trays? Mm -hmm. What exactly are those? You know, it, we thought it'd be fun to do like an anatomy of an Italian cookie tray. <laughs> nice. And I called all these different bakeries. Some did six cookies, some did 12 cookies. And then I found Maria. She does 25 cookies. Wow. And, and you're not talking about individual cookies. These are types of cookies. Individual types, types of cookies. Wow. All with their own type of dough. It's not just one <laughs> dough with different types of sprinkles. And she Whoa. had such a lovely story where it was her mother's business that she had grown mm -hmm. the mother passed away and still had all these orders to fill so Maria mm -hmm. just like stepped up to the plate her family was like how can you do this you have a full-time job and she yeah. was like I'm doing it oh, and now wow. she continues to do it it's a labor of love talk about bacon from the heart absolutely I, certainly uh, and another couple who has a lot of heart they decorate their home in such a unique way. Tell they us about do. that. So this is um, Angela Zampel. Um, she is the founder of uh, the Craft and Kitchen Marketplace mm -hmm. that is, I think, happening December 8th. I'm not sure, but she also has this brand called Hot Glue Heroes, and she finds all these vintage ornaments, and she adds glitter and tinsel, and <laughs> nice. it's so fun. And this just sort of, that aesthetic just expands through their household, where mm -hmm. everything is sort of like vintage and kitschy and sparkly and red and pink and uh, they actually decorated their house in October for oh us to my. shoot it for the holiday. Wow. And, yeah. they probably, and then at that point you probably leave it all up. They exactly. Say, it took this much effort. Let's just leave all the ornaments where they are. Exactly. Um, another thing that you mentioned is an activity that we can take part in and that's wreath making. I've yes. never done that before but it looks easy enough. It right? does look easy enough now that it's been broken down in steps from the people at Blythewold. Mm -hmm. So that was really great. Um, they had sent us a tutorial and photos and we put it together in a nice step by step. And it looks like you're really making bunches mm -hmm. and then, you know, just sort of um, affixing the bunches onto a wreath form. And then next thing you know, you have this beautiful wreath. Yeah. And those are just some of the many articles and things that you mention in this issue. Like you said, you got to start working on this a little earlier on so it can come out at the appropriate time. So were you already playing Christmas music in your own home? Did people think you were? nuts when you were starting to put this together well the funny thing is we do start so early that to me Christmas is over yeah oh you know? that's true yeah you've already like, been I'm enjoying done. it mm -hmm. you know so I'm sort of on to the next holiday and uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm constantly confused I walk into Target like did Halloween happen yet you yeah know? So. well we're we are not confused we want to focus <laughs> on Christmas we haven't enjoyed it as much as you have uh, so this is definitely the magazine that you're going to want to pick up at least thank you so much oh my pleasure you can grab your coffee today